Hey, what's going on everybody? Long time no see. I'm out here in the garden. We're doing the final harvest of the year. That's what I'm talking about. Getting all them tomatoes. Get some of that like peen. We got some beets down here. We're going to be picking up them beets too. Getting all that nitric oxide into our bloodstream, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Eating from the earth. It just feels so good to be alive. And I got to tell you what. I'm going to show you a little secret little known secret to helping keep your food longer for example when you've got your bananas keep them in a bunch they kind of circulate the energy between the bananas it keeps it fresher for longer but take a look at this i'll show you here when you go to harvest your tomatoes leave a little branch on there like this and it'll actually help the lifespan of the tomatoes which is really good instead of making them all separate so I recommend you go ahead and do that when you harvest them like that uh, and they'll last longer. We'll give them some sunlight to redden them up and they'll go from green to red and we'll have some wonderful tomatoes. And since we've got our hands on in the soil, right, we're getting down into the dirt, we of course want to uh, get our hands in that, right, because the soil improves our immune system because of the microbiology that exists in the soil and the interconnected nature that has with our body right for for uh, god only knows how long humans have been interacting with the soil which improves our immune system so when we avoid using pesticides herbicides insecticides things like that we've got nice organic soil like this we're putting all of those good microbes into our gut which improves the diversity and helps our immune system and our mood. Some of those little guys actually produce serotonin, right? So if you're trying to feel good, you want to help lift things like depression or feelings of sadness, eating from the earth can help you feel better if it contains those little microbes uh, that produce those neurotransmitters. So that's just exciting. I just wanted to share that with you. But keep up the organic food. You are supporting the people that are growing organic food, which is one of the most important things you could do during our time with major corporations being taken over. So we're here to fight back with our dollar and say enough's enough. We're going green, we're going organic, and we're going to grow it ourselves too, because then we learn a new skill and it just makes us feel so much better because we're talented, we have so much knowledge and wisdom that we can share with future generations, friends, and other people. So it's just really powerful. So yeah, I just wanted to share that with you, that the uh, veins of the plant are interconnected, so if you keep them together, they'll last a little bit longer and stay fresher for longer. Be real gentle with your food and uh, it'll take care of you too. Thanks so much for watching. Sorry, I haven't been on in a while. I've been so busy lately, but that's okay. I'll show you a little bit of my harvest and we'll go from there. Take care, everybody. Love you so much. Oh, by the way, Ollie, uh, is it Ollie Emmy? shout out to you thank you for donating to the channel i really do appreciate it um you're you're just so awesome when you guys donate to the channel it helps me do more get more great content out improve the quality of my videos um, every time i get investments like that i'm gonna put it right back in to uh, this business of helping people live a healthier and better and more connected lifestyle so thank you so much ollie I really do appreciate it shout out to you and take good care have a great day thanks so much oh my god check it out that's a lot of green onion Got one of my beets pulled up, looking really good. It's getting later in the day, the days are getting shorter, so I only got a little light left. Check out all those tomatoes. Man, we hit the jackpot. That's what I'm talking about. That's all just from one harvest. That's amazing, you know? I was pulling tomatoes every other day before, but now we can clearly tell that we got ourselves Quite the deal.